Hello again, everybody. This is Tom from everystepcalculus.com, everystepphysics.com. This video is on a calculus problem, changing polar coordinates to rectangular coordinates. Um, so let's do it. Index 8 to get to my menu. And we're going to scroll up. You can go screen by screen by pressing second. We need to get to the P's where the polar is. There's polar to rectangular. And this problem that I'm showing you is came off of Yahoo. Some student wanted to know the answer to this. So I wrote it down exactly the way he or she put it. And then I'm also going to do another one um, where radius equals 2 and theta equals pi. Um, you have to press alpha before you enter anything into these entry lines here. So we're going to go alpha. And he wanted to know what, you know, R. So he four times dead sine of theta. That would be the gold key times this key. Close off the parentheses. And so here's the system. You multiply both sides by r to get, to get it to the identity format, which is r squared. So we have to multiply both sides by r, which we've done here. And um, r squared is equal to the identity x squared plus y squared. And so x squared y squared equals 4 times r sine theta. x squared plus y squared. And then we Transfer the 4 over to this side, divide by that side by 4, both sides by 4. And I come up with this, and this, of course, equals to y. Kind of an identity, too, but that's one of the rules here in polar to rectangular. And so then we transpose the y over to the left side and make this equal to 0, and here's the answer. x squared plus y squared divided by 4 minus y equals 0. We'll go back and do another problem uh, where r equals 2 alpha 2 and alpha gold key. No, it's, it's a blue key, I guess. Here, I'll take that out and go to the blue key. There's pi. I always show you what you've entered so you can change it if you want. Say it's okay. So the x is equal to r cosine of theta is equal to 2 cosine of theta, etc., etc. This equals to minus 2. y is equal to r times sine of theta, 2 sine of theta, and 2 times 0 is 0, 0. So the answer is 0. So the answer is rectangular coordinates x and y minus 2, 0. So pretty neat, huh? Every step, calculus.com. Go to my site and subscribe so you can see more videos that I might uh, make. Have a good one.